so i'm going to create the field that note class has and those fields are title and content and please make sure that this title and content match with the document field that we have in the database firestore database if this uh, field do not match with the field that is present in the firestore database then it's going to it's not going to retrieve the data keep in your mind this title this uh, field that we are specifying here must match with the field value present in the firestore database now i'm going to create public constructor here for note I'm going to create two constructor one is empty constructor and second one is the constructor that take few parameters like string title and string content and I'm going to assign these to the field that we have created here so this third title equals to title this third content equals to content and that will assign the data and now finally we need to generate this setter and getter so i'm going to generate the setter and getter by using generate function and setter and getter select the fields and once you click on okay it's going to generate the setter and getter for us so this is the node class that we need to pass in this firestore recycler options so i'm going to pass that here node and i'm going to give the variable or object name as all nodes and now you are uh, using the new keyword i can create the new object of this firebase recycler option firestore recycler options dot builder and uh, here we need to pass the note as the class model model class and now here i'll set the query using set query method so query variable name is query and similarly we also need to give the model class that is node dot class okay and finally I need to build this so once this build method is called it's going to query the data from the notes collection in our fire store database all the data returned by those query is um, stored in this all nodes variable here and finally we can use this all nodes to uh, get the particular documents okay so now I need the adapters so if you remember we had created this sample adapter here and inside this we had created these variables and random colors and we had bind the data to the view okay we had done all these extra things right you may have you may remember that i said this is just for the testing purpose and we are going to use other ops other technique to retrieve the data from the firebase and display that in the cycle view now we don't need this adapter so here we need to create the separate adapter for this so we need to create the instance of firestore recycler adapter here is the option and it will take two parameters first is the model class and second is the view holder so i'm gonna give the name as node view holder which we have not created yet but we'll do that later so adapter i'm gonna give name as node adapter okay so first let's create this uh, model class so create node view holder but instead of that i'm actually going to go to the end of this file here and create it myself public class node view holder and it is going to extend the recycler view dot view holder okay and we need to create the matching constructor here as well and create the matching constructor okay just like that we have created this node view holder and that error is resolved now here you can see and now i'll create the object of this node adapter so just after this firebase recycler option i'm gonna create the node adapter equals to new firestore recycler adapter and it's going to uh, implement few methods automatically where we will bind the data and create the new view holder here i need to pass the query that is all nodes all nodes okay it will take the all nodes it, it is a list of data that is retrieved from the uh, firestore database okay just like what we did in the adapter here uh, we need to do the same thing there so instead of doing that i'm going to copy this file from here to this uh, node view holder here and paste it click on ok 
and create the new node view holder and pass the view as the parameter and let me uh, give the semicolon and similarly we need all these uh, variables okay so I'm gonna copy this as well copy these variables and paste inside this view holder here the node view holder click on ok and similarly we also need this because we are using the same title content and note card to display the data so it is similar so I'm gonna paste it here and inside this unbind view holder we have all these data so these are also same so I'm gonna copy this from here as well and paste inside the unbind view holder that we have just created okay here so we don't have this holder now actually uh, instead of this holder we need to use this node view holder so I'm gonna copy and paste this to replace the holder so replace all the instance of holder and now we don't have this title list view as well we don't have title list view and content list view but we have the note class and using the getter method we can get the title of the note and content of the note so note dot get title okay and this get title method is present inside this note here okay you can see this is the um, get met get title method that we are calling here and similarly for the content we can use note dot get content just like that and now this random color method is not present in the main activity it is actually present in the adapter so I'm gonna go here and copy this whole method and paste here okay just after this note view holder click on ok and now let's resolve others errors uh, similarly when we are passing this we need to use the note class now so note dot get title and it is uh, saying that we need to make this final so make this note final and similarly for this as well node dot get content okay and let's see we have one more error here so instead of this note view holder we need to pass the node view holder okay so this will resolve the error now uh, I know guys this is little bit advanced than if you are just uh, starting out with this application but uh, don't worry we are not doing anything extra here we had we are just doing same thing what we did in this adapter while creating this adapter we have we are creating the view holder we are uh, binding the data to the node title and node content that is present in this uh, layout which is in the node view layout right okay now we also need to change this adapter here so we don't need this so I'm gonna delete this uh, adapter and I'm going to delete this list and all the things that we created for that and here instead of using the set adapter to adapter I'm going to use node adapter okay so this is the only one change that we need to do now we also need to add one few things here so whenever the data change in the cloud fire restore database it's going to automatically reflect in the recycler view and it's going to listen for the data change all the time okay okay so whenever we close reopen the applications or when we are coming back from the other activity to the main activity we will listen for the data change in the fire restore database or in the notes collection so to do that we need to override this uh, on start and on stop okay so whenever the data uh, whenever the activity is started we are going to listen for the note adapter that is we are listening for the any change pushed by the database and once we close the data once the application is closed we will stop listening here because there is no point listening to the data changes if the application is already closed okay so we need these two uh, method is really essential here so now after adding all these things we are ready to run our applications and hopefully we will see the data that we have added to the fire store in the previous video so let me run this application also if you don't want this adapter here you can delete it now because we don't have any uses for this adapter now but uh, I prefer keeping it here just to uh, go back and check the code if I make any mistakes in this uh, main activity okay 
okay guys the application is running okay now you can see we have this data and this data is directly fetched from the firestore database okay and if i click on this we can see the details of this node and if i click on this we'll see the details of this node as well and if i click on this we'll see that okay so now just to demonstrate just to check if this is working correctly or not i'm gonna add one more extra node here so let's click on this add node button and i'm gonna change this to i'm gonna delete it okay and write the content of the node now i'm gonna save this and when we save this node that node is automatically displayed here okay let me add one more and uh, let me give the title as something i'm gonna select all copy and paste it again and again just to make the this content longer okay that's enough now i'll save this node and we will see this node appearing automatically in the recycler view so here you can see this node appeared automatically without any refresh or nothing so that's how we retrieve the data using the firebase query and display the data using fire firestore recycler options and firebase firestore recycler adapter in the recycler view so i hope you guys understood what i was trying to do here if don't you can uh, always ask me a questions if you get any error you can ask me any questions on the our facebook group or in the comment box below and this is it for this part we will i will see you in the next part till then goodbye and have a good day